The U.N. General Assembly is set to convene in just two weeks, and rumors are swirling that President Trump will be taking the opportunity to reboot Israeli-Palestinian peace talks. ILTV's Aaron Porras is here to tell us more. So, Aaron, where are things with the negotiations now? Uh, well, we've seen a lot of effort recently from the Trump administration to restart peace talks. Uh, talk, you know, things fell apart back in 2014. Uh, and ever since then, with the exception of security coordination, there has been pretty much no advancement in peace negotiations whatsoever. Um, especially, you know, and things didn't really get any better uh, with all the skeptic skepticism that was following right. uh, Jared Kushner's visit as envoy to the Middle East, especially since the, the White House had not officially recognized a two-state ideology, nor, uh, nor condemned settlement construction. So um, it's really just... Uh, it, you know, with, right now we're really just waiting on them to come together. Luckily, Kushner did grease the wheels at least a little bit because they're willing to meet with, with President Trump. Right, the Trump is going to be speaking with them one-on-one -on -one right. at the UN General Assembly. Now, is, is it too much to hope that these talks could really go somewhere right now? I, I mean, it's not, it's not too much to hope, but at the same time, it really just depends on whether or not the two sides are willing to come down and sit down and talk. This is not the first time that, right. uh, that a president of the United States has come forward with a peace plan. Trump will not be the first. Uh, unfortunately, the way things are going, probably not the last. But again, you know, if he's he's there, the infrastructure to set the peace talk is there. He's going to be meeting with them at the UN. And if Israel and Palestine can come up with something that they can agree on and, and are open, then something could come out of this, sure. All right, so. well, let's check out the details of your report. The American president will meet privately before the assembly with both Israeli Prime Minister Netanyahu and Palestinian Authority President Abbas, his first talks with them since May. The White House is hopeful about its latest push for peace following the envoy led by Jared Kushner to the region a few weeks ago. While a formal peace plan still needs to be drawn up, which could happen by the end of the year, Kushner's team returned from their Middle East tour feeling encouraged. That's because they were apparently able to sway the Palestinians to remain involved with the talks and coordinated with both Jordan and Saudi Arabia to convince President Abbas that Trump was taking the peace talks seriously. Indeed, Trump campaigned on his promise to land the, quote, ultimate deal between Israel and the Palestinians and visited the region personally last May to meet with leaders from both sides. Now it looks like he'll be having more one-on-ones both before and after the United Nations convenes its General Assembly later this month. This will be President Trump's first meeting with Netanyahu and Abbas since the progress made by Kushner's peace envoy, so we'll just have to wait and see if the ultimate deal is truly on the way.